Hi. In this segment, um, we're going to put a component onto a circuit board. Um, we removed this earlier. Let's say we tested it, everything was fine. So we're going to put it right back in again. So uh, normally, when, if it was a new component, it would have much longer leads. The leads are uh, the piece of metal sticking out of the ends of whatever component you have. Um, each of these things is a component. This is a component. Um, as a component goes, it's called a capacitor, but uh, we're just going to stick it right back in there. So find the holes, and we flip it around. Just going to kind of push it down here so we can get a better grip on it. There we go. And now we need to bend the leads down. <coughs> push that down. There we go. Don't have a lot of meat on this one, but that's we'll do what I can. There we go. There we go. Um, if you can help it, something about soldering when you're uh, installing components is try to get them as uh, tight to the board as possible, because um, you really the soldering will give it some strength, of course, to hold it in there. Uh, but really, the only the only purpose for solder is to make an electrical connection to the board. So you really don't want to use the solder as the strength of the connection. Uh, that's why you, you, you pull the leads through, you bend them down, you try to make it as tight as possible just by using the leads. So we, uh, I'm fairly happy with how that's looking. Get this guy going again. Today. You have to turn it all the way up to get the uh, butane going. There we go. Probably heard the difference there. Really kind of sounds like a little flamethrower. Okay, so that's going. Now we're going to get some of my 6040 rosin core solder. Just take a piece off of there. And we hold it down. And it just kind of probably going to quite not quite hot enough yet. Give it another second or two. Hold that on to, on the lead and the uh, the trace soldering iron. Hold that on there again. There we go. See how that gets all nice and liquid? You fill in the holes with it. There you go. And that, that's what you want right there. Nice, shiny, smooth, soldered surface. Let's just get this other one real quick. Doesn't take long at all or much solder. There you go. That's it. That's how you solder.